Hey! That's a tortoise. I got nothing. We're playing the airship. Welcome back. Hammer Brothers, here we are. Let's do it. Airship time. Mmm. Mmm. I'm psyched. I'm pumped. Mmm. Yeah. You good? Okay, yeah, I'm good. You're pissing out fire flower, uh, uh, fireballs right hey, there. Hey, children. I'm sorry. You're peeing out fireballs yeah. right there. That's that's always such a funny way to say it. He pee. I'm a, I'm a. So have we figured out how these are staying together and flying? Uh, you know what? Koopa magic. Oh, dang. Yeah, An another fantastic trick that I cannot seem to show you. Really? What? You don't have to go across. I them. know. And you're not fast enough anyway. It's another one of those great design techniques I like to talk about where you are in. Yeah, that's easier. Where you're introduced to a concept before it, it, you see it in a life or death situation. You know, like, oh, here's how a bolt works. And you get to figure out how, oh, not in this one. You get to figure out how the boat works, uh, the bolt, before you actually have to use it to cross gaps. How do you jump? <sighs> Wrong Koopaling. Oh, yeah, there's no way I was going to get out of that one. <sighs> I was thinking of uh, Iggy Koopa later on in the ice world, where you yeah. can actually jump off his, uh... This is going to be interesting. Jump off his, uh, uh circus balls. I wonder if you can beat Wendy like that. Yeah. Well, I, don't, I don't think I'm gonna get that far. It's doable. I have faith in you. <gasps> oh, that helped. Got some frog yeah. snakes. <laughs> oh. Just over the top, watch out for the wrenches. Oh, <laughs> now it's now it's Wendy. Oh. It's two. Oh, you did, ah, it. did it! You freaking did it! <laughs> Oh man, I'm clapping. Oh yeah. Light golf <laughs> claps because I don't want to clip the audio. <laughs> wow, good job, man. That's you've never done that before, huh? That's that's a first. I tried. That's cool. <laughs> Boy, good first job. I did a boom boom. Now I do a Wendy. Yeah. Freaking lucky. There's the king. And he says, "Oh me, oh my, you've been transformed. Shall I change you back with this wand?" Yeah, sure. Well, if he thinks that you're a frog, but you're actually a person in a frog suit, what's he going to turn you into? Mm. A frog wearing a person suit? Ugh, horrifying thought. Anyway. My favorite level in Super Mario Bros. Whoops! 3. Oh, it's on! <sighs> oh, <laughs> accident or not, this is on. Coming for it. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. All right. <laughs> Get back. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> uh oh. Oh boy. Oh, the give battle. It, give it back. The battle is on. Okay, yeah, you can just, just grab it. Just take it. Save it. <laughs> I still won anyway. You did still win. 
All right, World Four, my favorite level in Super Mario one? Brothers. Yeah, uh, I think it's the. I forget. I think it might be the further off one. No. No. Okay. My favorite level in Super Mario Brothers Three, <laughs> Land of the Giants, just because I just love the idea of a. Just seeing huge versions of stuff you normally see. And the, the block breaking the four regular blocks. There's just a lot of neat stuff going on in this the, this level. They're not going to actually do <laughs> something. <laughs> mm. Yeah, clear out the colossal block. So you can fly up to the little waterfall secret. Now, how would this get up there? Uh, wood blocks floating in the air with a the water oasis. Mm -hmm. You got nothing, do you? It's a video <laughs> game. Okay, guess how, I'll go with that. How do regular brick blocks just float in the air? I don't know. I guess you're right. All right. Woo, jeez. Really close on that one. Remember, uh, one at a time here. If you get a second one, it'll erase the first one. Wait, what? Oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah, there. in this particular section, anyway. The bonus area is, like, later on, like, in World 8, the one where, you know, all the one-ups shoot out. Nope, no no tail attack underwater. You, just, you can't hit that one. Then why put it there? It's because. You're on your own. All right. Oh, oh. Oh, your hubris. <laughs> your hubris has gotten the better of you. Too bad there weren't also, like, super huge piranha plants coming out of there. I mean, there are in, you know... Yeah. They're on. Yep, two. See, look, aren't you glad I, I uh, took your fire flower <laughs> off your hands now? I guess. Yeah. You should be thanking me. Alright, level. <sighs> is it this one? Oh, I know which one this one is. I don't like this level. Is this? is this the underground one? Nope. Oh. This is the big sized <laughs> water level. Fortunately, fortunately, small, uh, there's, cheap cheeps. there's, yeah, fortunately the cheap cheeps are regular size. Yeah, why? <sighs> because, do you dare want to see what a giant <laughs> fish looks like in this level? Well, you got big Bertha. Yeah, but do you want to see what bigger Bertha looks like? Oh, not, not really. I sure don't. The, the name of the fish that just eats you is it has a different name. Big Bertha throws out the uh, the, the little fish, but the one that throws out the, the one that just eats you is called Boss Bass. How'd that become the, the the name of the big black lady in the in Super Mario Brothers the movie? Or is that because nobody actually played the game before they came over? There's the movie? actually a ton of references to the Mario games in the movie. They're just all stupid. No, they're hard to see. Like the uh, the bar they go to is called. Oh crap! <laughs> is it? <laughs> uh, the bar they go to is called the Boom Boom Room. Yeah. And there's a lot of different different names like that. So light up signs for a place called Thwomps. Now is it true that uh, what John Leguizamo said that they did the movie Tank? That's what he <laughs> says. He says that uh, uh, him and uh, Bob Hoskins and. Uh, Dennis Hopper. Uh, Dennis Hopper all did shots of scotch in between takes. Well, Dennis Hopper, I would definitely believe it. Mm. <laughs> but then uh, uh, what Bob Hoskins was saying in an interview before before he passed, he said that uh, 
worst movie. It's the one movie he regretted. Yeah, but what he also said was the reason he did the movie in the first place was because he signed on to a completely different script. Yeah. The script that he read for the film originally, he loved and wanted to be a part of it. And when he got there to film, it was a completely different script from the one he, he wanted to do. See, I would love to see that script. And he said it was that on top of the fact that the, the two directors were a, a couple who had never directed a film before. He said it, it was just sloppy all around. I will say I will say this for the Super Mario Brothers movie, though. Very interesting looking movie. Oh! And you've died. Yeah. Like, no other movie really looks like that. And it looks really cool, I think. I guess I like the book on tape. <laughs> I think I got the cassette somewhere here. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, coming up on Hammer Brothers, I'm going to check YouTube and see if anyone's put that cassette tape online. And if not, I should do a rip of it. So I should. Should. Yeah. I mean, it's, I mean, those people, those turtle tapes those people at uh, Super Mario Brothers, the movie archive, that website, mm -hmm. if they don't have a copy, I'll see if I can't get them some audio. That'd be cool. Stay tuned.